innovative, progressive, avant-garde, and most importantly, Filipino. Since 2006, Design Laboratory Buen Salido Architects has, to say the least, left an impression on architecture in the Philippines. Buen Salido Architects is really an architecture, interior, and an urban design laboratory. The firm's philosophy in a phrase is random responses. Life gives like a particular person different random events, and it's really how you respond to those events that uh, sort of define your life. In every architectural problem, we throw at the problem different random design solutions. We try to piece them together to come up with a coherent whole, and that's what makes up the entire design. With an approach that can be described as both experimental and process-oriented, Jason and his team have left a stamp in their designs that have become uniquely their own. One competition that we participated in is the pinakamagandang bahay sa Balat ng Lupa. Yung design solution that comes from the world beauty. Ano ba yung maganda sa paningin mo? We introduced the secondary skin, which can also act as protection from the elements and barlolay decoration. Because Filipinos would love to decorate their jeepneys, their houses. So um, dun may incorporate yung Filipino identity. We incorporate din namin yung principal ng bahay kubo na inangat the entire house para magkaroon ng silong sa ilalim which becomes uh, multifunctional, can become yung laundry area, dun pwede magsampay or dun pwede magpatulog ng bata. Dun namin binigay yung idea na pagiging beautiful can um, depende dun sa tao na gagamit. Recently, we got shortlisted to come up with a design for the first two iconic buildings of the Cultural Center of the Philippines. It's the Performing Arts Theater and the Artist Center. We based the final form on uh, seashell and I think the, the most important concept out of the whole architectural composition is the idea of weaving. We put together architecture and landscape in one singular composition because we wanted to represent that our identity as Filipinos is really, if you break it down into the basics, is a weaving of different kinds of identities. This uh, competition we joined last 2009, we were one of the finalists for the Annual Visionary Design Competition. We got the idea of the structure from the coral reef. The cross section of the coral reef is perforated, so this reflects the structure. Uh, natural lighting also serves as an transparent solar panels to illuminate the interiors during nighttime. We want to try to take the principles of uh, Filipino architecture, like the Bahay Kubo, translate them uh, in physical form uh, in today's setting, but maybe get the principles of those Filipino architectural manifestations and uh, try to make them fit in the contemporary setting by using modern materials and, and things like that. When Sadido Architects likes to push, we want to give original ideas and we want people to see new designs. And we are also global, meaning we want to mix being globally competitive into the local setting. We try to push the Philippines into a global design scene by taking Filipino concepts and trying to turn them into contemporary ideas that are also very suitable to Philippine setting. We have three major goals. The first is to, I guess, try to change the design landscape here in uh, the local setting just to open the minds of uh, the Filipinos that, hey, this is a new solution, uh, this is a new possibility, you might want to take this route. Uh, the second major goal of the company is, I guess, to uplift the current state of uh, design in the society. And uh, the third, and I think the most important of all, is to try to redefine Filipino architecture. You know, Filipino architecture is still very much intact. Maybe the, the way to uplift uh, the design uh, I guess situation in the Philippines is to try to redefine Filipino architecture but in a contemporary manner. Veering away from the conventional, Buen Salido Architects aims to stretch the possibilities of design in the Philippines, piecing together the random responses of life and crafting them into tangible and contemporary structure and space.